welcome back to the show. The show is Elevate with your main man. They call me Disc Jockey Vin. Nasiko Pekangu Loco Studio. I have a special guest in the building, Balulu the Icon. Madness. Mambo Vipi. <laughs> Niko Piti. Yeah, me, why Balulu the Icon? Uh, Balulu, it was a name I was given when I was still in uh, high school, uh, primary actually. Yeah. Na mwalimu wetu wa Mao. Balulu. Nilikuwa chopi. Lazima ulikuwa mtundu hapa na Buda. Balulu ikai jina ya chopi. No, 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 ukifanya research ya Balulu ni Balulu was a king of Ur. He ruled like 40 good years. Balulu was a king. He was a king. Hey, king in Buda. Eh, hey, <laughs> mtu wa zanga chini hivyo. <laughs> <laughs> ni vile ma king ni wengi Kenya I say. Ah, uh, honestly proclaimed king. Unajua kila mtu kila mtu anajiamini tu kwa industry. Ndio lakini. Anyway so Mr. Balulu, why yeah, yeah. Balulu the icon? The icon ni toka wapi? The icon ni toka kwa mafans. Ma, mafans? Mafans walikuwa like, we mbona tunafaa kukuwa na mahali, we uko tu tofauti. Iyo hey, kwanza ni notice jana. Hey, yeah. wasi wako walitesa jana online. Kwa kitu, <laughs> eh, vino stag, tag, tag, tag. Hey, Buddha. Niko na true fans. Fan base no Big up sana. <laughs> yeah, and can you describe your style as an artist? Uh, Mine is the same. I do, I do any style. Yeah. Uh, mostly uh, na based on bounce music. Napenda ni Bambe Msee. Sipendi kuona Msee ako tu. Nataka nione Msee amenuka, amebambika. Eh, amefeelio. Unajua? Eh. And I like something about your production team. Yaani mm-hmm. you guys are daring. Mm-hmm. Unajua zile ngoma mbili nimecheza, nimecheza na saka mm-hmm. na ile design. Mm-hmm. Na ile tempo nyote tu mnachezea. Unajua wasanii wengi waogopea hiyo tempo. <laughs> ya kuenda tuende tuende. Watu waogopea hiyo tempo. <laughs> Watu wasema acha nicheze haka tempo safe sijui kaso, sijui kali mambo ma movie. Sinikimbize. Eh yeah. but anyone no, 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 your king in on the track we are elevating. And sometime back you told me about an EP that you guys released. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you tell me by the Buni nifunze kama mtu track class 1. Mm-hmm. EP ni nini? Ah uh, EP naweza sema ni half half album. Si album full. Ni ngoma ka nne. Lakini sasa mimi ni ule mjanje is obvious balulu I can nikaongeza na bonus mbili. So is there a difference between an EP and a mixtape? Ah uh, a mixtape na EP it's almost similar. But yeah. sasa unaona kuna extended plays na kuna mixtape totally so different. Tuseme, so so tuseme EP ndio ile na group of schools. Mixtape ni ya Ipo ni ara yengine. Hiyo ni DJ Vin amesema. Hapana mimi nauliza tu. Mimi nauliza. Mimi nauliza zile maswali zile imetumiwa pia. Tunaweza sema hivyo by the way do extended plane is something huge than a mixtape. Yeah. If I'm not wrong. Okay. Yeah. So I preferred actually I was to release an a mixtape but nikaona why a mixtape? You are the king. Naweza panga EP na igo. Ngoja ngoja ngoja. Ah unajua usijifanye mtu wa mambo sana hapa. Sema ukweli. Ulikaiva ukamka smojo kasema nataka kwa mixtape why I'm the king acha ni to EP ah not really not really me by the way before ni release ngoma kuna ma fans wenye wako tu hapo nje me we invite fans at least kwa studio na mwambie hebu niambie ingekuwa wewe sasa umesikia ni mpie kwa hapo nje ungefilaje mziki uh, others pia natumia kwa DJs and stuff and like that about you hiyo naweza kukubali. Yeah. Unajua kitu sijaelewa na mm-hmm. uh, artist watanisamehea. Mm-hmm. Unajua ngoma ikiisha ukinitumia ngoma uniambie what do you think about this track? Mm-hmm. Unajua kwa kwangu tutaita change. True that. Jungoma tayari isha. Isha isha kwa imeenda. Hey. But then I've noticed kuna time hata hata wewe mwenyewe unanitumia ngoma ngoma. Sure. Unaniambia vin una una filaje jengo man i think you need to do sana wanafa wanafa pia ku as much as as much as everyone has an opinion nitakwambia kitu labda itakufurahisha nitakwambia kitu labda utasema eh hey, by the way i can accommodate the idea and make this track bigger, bigger than what it is yeah. exactly then sasa shida si wasanii wote utakuchukua ideas vizuri this is kenya yeah. what <laughs> motivates you uh kuingia studio mimi kenya ni motivate ni daily nikiamka napata god ameni kafiti napata kuna like for instance kuna station fulani na cheza ngoma yangu so ina ni keep moving like ah kumbe i can be played naweza itwa interview naweza enda show unajua naweza piga look ni tese fan aseme yenyewe balulu leo mimi ni represent vile inafaa kwanza kwa ile ngoma ya saka na sikia uki event vibaya sana hiyo <laughs> ngoma ya saka una eventing vibaya sana na kana kuna jamu umetumia mangoma achezi alafu blue tick tu sio hivyo ni vile tuseme tu reality wasanii wengi wanalia mambo na airplay interviews uh, okay ni situation yenye iko not only in Kenya hadi outside Africa bado iko si kila mse atacheza ngoma yako na pia kila mtu ako na time yake okay. ukiona umeambiwa bado ni bado 
lakini for me kwa mziki sasa niliweka like ni kitu imekuwa ni kitu inaongelelewa so acha ni yake hapa kwa mziki isikikwe lakini sikutageta vibaya sana so that takes us to the next question as an artist balulu the icon the artist mm-hmm. what are the challenges we pata kwa industry uh, challenges challenges uh, stuck in complain about finance uh, i believe team yenye niko nayo and the people who are giving me support like uh, one of them ni wewe big man DJ Vin uh, siwezi complain about finance but uh, Kenya naweza sema challenge mostly ni unaona when you release a, a new song now you want to start the media tour and stuff obviously hakuna mtu atakusikia kama wewe mwenyewe hujaenda hizi one two just kikwa alikuwa huko anafanya nini unajua so inakuanga hard kupata interview as such but nashukuru Mungu dogo ya dogo tu time yake pia kifike imekuja sasa shida shida ya majama wetu wa Kenya wapenda mm. monotony sana you don't listen to the kawaida names kawaida. artists mm-hmm. the kawaida tracks mwenye yako pale and sometimes you are too lazy you are too lazy mm-hmm. you are too lazy the only time like a dj plays a jam mm-hmm. some dj's those who don't do their researches and stuff true ile time ya miskia ngoma ni hit akisia ngoma kwa chat sijui za kiss tv e hey, buda ameenda kwa youtube ndio ndio sio ngoma ilitoka 5 months ago ndio sasa kaka kuna ngoma kuna ngoma fulani ya ethic ni cheza kwa hiyo ile itwa figa figa mhm unajua kuna majamo mengi sana hajui figa ilitoka wapi ilitoka lini kwanza haji haji figa ilitoka wapi haji ili sample wa wapi mhm jingo ma ilitokea ni kesi gani kwa Hey. Like I yeah, true, true, yeah, true. Yeah, they contact yeah. they contact track mm. wali wa everyone wa tell me what do you think about this new age artist our oh, odi the odi fever generation ni wave ni wave tulikuwa na wave ya sauti soul tukisoma soma tulikuwa na wave ya kina madi tulikuwa na wave ya kina kenrezi kuna wave ya balulu ina kama ina balulu ina kama eh yeah, kuna Tringoje. wave ya kina Tringoje. Eh yeah. vuta mbele tunafa kujitayarisha. Unajua mvua ikikama unajua ngala lazima uchukue gamu. Si mnaona tu dalili. Raincoats. Sasa balulu tunajitayarisha aje. Amoni dalili. Dalili ndio hizo zishakaa. Wewe sasa ukiona ndio hii mvua yenyewe inakuja na niko tao. Utafanya nini? Yo alafu so about the wave. Mhm. Is it a good thing or a bad thing from your point of view? For me it's good. Nakumbuka back then when we were still kids. Tulikuwa tunaimba una jump una ruka. Unakanyaga una unajua eh yeah, kina bobi mapesa it's the same it's, it's the same thing actually ni gengeto nime ime ndasemaje ni baraka twist eh yeah, kuna venye imeongezwa tu chumvi mbili tatu na miaka yake ikapelekwa chini kidogo riengi kaongezwa na waka waka less censorship exactly alafu unajua pia uh, our new generation generation ya sahii nataka kusikia kenye inaimbwa sahii yeah like they want the, the real thing bona tufichane it is this way but now you know now the problem comes with this real thing kuna watu wanateta sana wanasema the content is too maybe explicit not too family friendly so how will you answer those people alafu clothes sasa tukisema figa ni explicit clothes uh kwangwaru tutasema ni hapana sasa niambie sasa point yako ni gani sasa hii ni kenyan music yeah ini kenyan vibe na ukiona like Tanzania wame stick into that pure swahili yenye lazima uingie kwa dictionary utafute alisema ukiona Niger ni Niger ukiona UG ni UG Kenya tubaki kuwa Kenya history ya siji tumeingia siji bongo tena mjaluo fulani anaitwa Omondi ashakuwa lava lava basi mbe kwambia shida ni moja mm-hmm. Kenya tunapenda monotony sana hiyo ndio shida tunaenanga na wave ile kitu inashika wacha ikaa sasa hivi ile bongo imeshika mm-hmm. so tunapata wasanii wetu kuna wale they are so busy wanataka ku sound kama kama artist fulani wa TZ tuwasikizwe na kuna mtu ali alileta concern nyingine ikanibamba sana mm-hmm. alisema unacheki hivi unataka sijui ati ethic bundox gangs jua na imba nini na nini na nini mm-hmm. ukapitia message wanaisema zile ngoma ase wa TZ pia wanasema mm-hmm. As in, similar it's similar ni more or less the same yeah but then i believe i, I believe sometimes you are hypocrites 
Eh? Na tujipendi. We are, we are hypocrites. Tunajifanya mm. tiati holier than thou at your skizangi story. Twerking atujui twerking. Mm. Lakini kadibia kitongoma ya kutoa mbaya mbaya kwa ni YouTube views na show. Tunapanda kupanda. Status manzi ya tukumui. Unaona tu kadibi. Nikuza nini mabesti wetu wote. Yeah, and then you have a new jam. Lakini hiyo tutaingia baadaye pale after the hit or miss. Mm-hmm. Kuna segment ya nguo hit or miss. Mm-hmm. Lakini hiyo tutaingilia baadaye. Mm-hmm. But as for now, let's go back into music. Show is elevate with your main host DJ Vin aka this Jockey Vin and my special guest Balulu underscore the icon. Lakini kwa sababu kwa mziki. Let's elevate.